In this video, I'm going to first show you an easy way to add plot style tables to AutoCAD. Then after that, I'm going to talk a little bit about the STB file that's included with my template. Okay, so if you've downloaded the files I've included with my template, you should have an STB file. That's the plot style table. Copy that to your clipboard. Just right click on it and copy in whatever folder you currently have it stored in. You'll be in AutoCAD, type options, go to plot and publish, go to plot style table settings, click here, add or edit plot style tables. And all this does is it opens the folder where AutoCAD stores all of these files. So what you'll do now is you'll just paste that file into here. And I think uh, maybe newer AutoCAD versions will find it right away next time you print but you might have to close AutoCAD and reopen it before you actually see the file when you try to set up your, uh, I guess, your layouts and your print settings. So just be aware of that, but that's really all there is to adding new plot style tables to AutoCAD. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go over a few things pertaining to the STB file itself. I'm just gonna get into my print dialog. I'm just gonna go here to edit and my my basic STB file is just that. It's incredibly basic. I'll actually only, other than normal, I only have two different plot styles. One is normal with butt end. I'll show you what that does in just a second. And this wipeout one, this is in case the user wants their wipeouts a different color, but they still want them to print this white color. So I'll get out of this. So I'm gonna go to the layer dialog now with the STB file, you actually set your plot style. There's a column here. You can choose your plot style. I notice most stuff is set to normal. That means all the properties, the layer color, the line type, it'll default to the rounded ends. It'll basically what you see is what you get. It's going to print to that. The butt end is just for thicker lines and I guess some other lines like grid lines. I don't, I don't want the rounded ends on them. So you can see all my bold layers, they have that um, normal with butt end. And then if I scroll down to my wipeout layer, you can see the plot style is set to wipeouts. So this makes this layer unique, not really the layer, but the plot style that if I change this color, like let's say like a bright red or orange, just so it stands out, just so the user can see where their wipeouts are more easily, it's still gonna print white, so that's the only difference. So this hatch layer here, that's gonna print as close as your printer can get to this color. But um, this will print white no matter what color you set it to, unless you change the plot style right here. 